Triss could not help Garrett, yet she did direct him to Corrine Tilly, an Oneromancer and an expert at finding the lost and the missing. Guided by Corrine Tilly, the Witcher had a dream. In it, Ciri and I, the Bard Dandelion, were reunited. Geralt now knew that to find Ciri, he would first need to find his dear old friend. I like this tiny, you know? Okay, so let's just... and question this person, I would say. Before going to... get to the bathhouse, let's go to this one. Ay, Jesus Christ, I don't know. She called me mutant. La muy jodía. She called me mutant. And like a... It's in here, no? Question... Who's Reuben? About Dandelion's disappearance without raising a suspicion. Anybody there? Open up. Without raising a suspicion. Anybody there? Open up! Need to talk to the owner. I know he's here. I'm not sure that matters as he's terribly busy. Busy? With what? Entertaining important guests. In that case, tell him there's another one at the door. Geralt of Rivia. And I'm not leaving till I see him. <laughs> Very well. I shall try. Please wait. Siggy Rulvan cordially invites you to join him. I'm happy. Um, Ladies go to the bathhouse and talk to CG Ruben. Get undressed and put the clothes. Ooh! <laughs> Today, too many. Oh, it's are happening. Sexy girl. Splendid. Siggy Reuven awaits in the next room. Hi, boy, hey? Not fun, you have. <laughs> oh, he doesn't blush. Mia. Uh, what is her problem, Lol? Those feet, though. Yes. Um, should I just go in? Yeah. Easy, Cleaver. Or son Junior's a dead man. I'll have my scribe send you a notice. You don't have a scribe. And we'll eliminate Junior when and only when all of us say I. Oh They were together, Lord. Even your guest. <laughs> Why the fuck you let him in here? Because I want to talk to him. This is Geralt of Rivia. Good to see you again. As always, I'm out of the swiping loop. Who the fuck are you? Ah, I thought that was one our friend. Okay. Uh, I'm a witcher. Need to talk to Ziggy. What am I gonna say? I think I'll let your host introduce me. He's a witcher. The very one who first foiled an attempt on Foltest's life, and then killed that money. Allegedly. But I didn't kill Foltest. And hello to you too, Dijkstra, Ruvin, whatever they call you these days. Last we met, Geralt thrashed me silly and crushed my ankle. I really wonder what he's got in store this time. Got intruders. Someone just snuck inside the bathhouse. Several men. What the fuck's he on about? Plowing fortune teller. Assassins! Please, no! Ah! Lol. Bloody hell. I fucking knew it. Any weapons tucked away? Just a few. Just a few, lol. 
He has a gun. Now I have a mace. Just relax, eh? Ay, 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 who is Ah, this one. So I need to hit those that have clothes because the others are my friends. Oh. I swear I don't have my. Good work, gents. Terribly sorry for that incident. My security failed. I'll get to the bottom of who, why, and how. They were whoreson scum. That's the bottom of who and how right there. Don't start that again. Especially not in front of our guest. Who pranced in right before they attacked. Coincidence? Why do I doubt it? Let's give him a chance to explain. Get a seahorse and talk to him. I don't believe I know your friends. Not gonna introduce me to your friends? Good thing happens not here. He tanned the hide on my ass for being so rude. Francis Bedlam you know, but then who's not heard of this patron of the fine arts and supporter of entrepreneurs of limited initial means? And the dwarfs Carlo Vares, known also as Cleaver. Carlos in entertainment. Where is Pitin? I'm looking for Horson Jr. Interesting. What do you want with him? Personal matter. It's personal. <laughs> uh, Geralt takes his privacy very seriously. Spying on him, having him followed, is a bloody nightmare. Still, he was lots more trusting when he was looking for Marigold. Gentlemen, you out of your fucking minds. A chat session. Poor son's out to get us, and he'll succeed eventually. We've got to kill him first. So by all means, you sit here, soak, fart, and watch the bubbles rise, while I send my boys to Horse Sun's hidey holes. They'll make some noise, flush the bugger out. And you, Geriatric, or whatever your plowing name is, want to find Horse Sun? Find me first. So where will I find you now? I hope I find you before Clever does. Clever. Clever is a dwarf. Any clue on Junior's whereabouts? Be grateful for any lead. Siggy? It's worth a try. Geralt's got a knack for finding people. And he's discreet. A value in itself. Leave you to it then. I'll, uh, look in on you tomorrow, Francis. Finish he called me talk. it. So how about we get dressed? Sure, sure. Then we'll talk. In private. Right mess that was. Never thought I'd be glad to see the man responsible for my taking frequent baths. If you're any cleaner for it, gotta say it was worth breaking your ankle. <sighs> it healed poorly. Can you believe it? I must soak it in hot water at least six times a day now. Failing that, it bloody pounds like the bells of Beauclair at dawn. Normal, you're constantly in water. Sorry to hear that. You're sorry? Well, consider it resolved then. Now, mind showing some added compassion could mean a miraculous recovery to me. How? Listen, Reuven. No, Dijkstra. 
Just not in the mood for your code names, passwords, and other bullshit. I'm here on specific business. If you want to listen, listen. If not, I'd rather you spared me your wit and threw me out now. Ah, uh, what's the harm? Talk. You think Cleaver will find Horson? He might. He might not. But he'll burn down half the city trying. What waste. Leave him to it, I say. Work alone. Any ideas? Junior's got areas of the city where he's strong. Penetrate them, look around. But be discreet. None of this speed and fury and swinging your steel cock about. Okay, okay, okay. Your colleagues, aware of your past? It's a sour. Your partner's aware of your past? They know you're Sigismund Dijkstra, former head of Redanian intelligence? <laughs> Cleaver, Bedlam and Junior. Well, I'd call them my partners if we built a mill to grind flour for the folk of nearby hamlets. But we just need to stay out of each other's ways, agree from time to time. That doesn't make us partners. Do they know who I am? Was. Bedlam, sure. The others most likely suspect. But we just don't talk about it. No need to. Do they know why? Pretty clear you and Bedlam don't want a war with Junior. Why? Let me tell you what I told King Vizimir time and time again. War doesn't solve any problems. It breeds trouble. Trouble you then have to solve by other means. Make no mistake, someone's behind Horson's actions. I'll not end him until I know who. Hmm. Makes sense to ask around, I guess. Junior might be in hiding, but he's gotta be collecting income. Couldn't afford to cut himself off. Gambling. That's his big earner. Junior controls the largest casino in town. I'll never forget. Hierarch Kemmelfart raised all kinds of hallowed hell there once. Bugger bet and lost his ruby ring. Then the there's the arena in the city's bowels. Betting scheme generates near as much as the casino. They're always looking for hired muscle there. Suppose you could always search Horson's house. Though I doubt you'll find him there. Maybe some clue though. Where's Junior's casino? Near the Temple Watch Towers. Horson's gotten out to do with the casino officially. So careful what you say. Try not to arouse any suspicions. It's okay, it's okay. Um Arena sounds promising. Where's that? Sewers beneath Gildorf. But you'll have to enter through the pits. Endure the stench of poverty on the way. Okay. Now, Junior loves a good fight. Wager he'd give a lot to see a real witcher in action. Mentioned Horson's got a house. Where is it? Solid townhouse on Temple Isle, just on the other side of the bridge. Wouldn't wager me knickers on finding him there. Junior's not that stupid. But... See if I can't find Horson at the casino or the arena. Might talk to Cleaver as well, though. Do what you will. Just be cautious. Orson's expecting payback, I've no doubt. Thanks Too many for people, though. Extra. Just go, Witcher. And if like... you can't find the slimy bastard, come and see me. I know him well. Might figure something out. Master Spite must find just some progression. A master spy and master criminal. Interesting progression. Why? Truth be told, they're awfully similar. Both about maintaining a net of informers, being tough in negotiations, bribing officials, the occasional assassination. Same old shit. Yeah. Except you used to do that in the name of some ideal. And now? Now I've decided I've slaved enough for ideals. The time I worked for myself, and thus far. It's been going rather well. Um, you in contact with Radovid? You in contact with Radovid? <laughs> See, you're as witty as ever. 
No, I'm not in contact with him. I prefer it remain that way. Never quite forgave you for conspiring with Philippa Eilhart? Radovid doesn't forgive. Not anything. Not anyone. And especially not the sorceress of the lodge. <clears throat> Any news of Philippa? Philippa Eilhart. Had any news? Just good. Meaning? After Radovid popped her eyes out, she disappeared without a trace. If I have any luck, she's finally eating dirt. Thought you two were close. We were, until Philippa sent assassins after me. Like, I don't know these people, but holy shit. Listen, Dandelion's missing. Any idea what might have happened to him? Same thing that happens to anyone who steps on Junior's toes. Meaning? He's surrounded by splendid virgins who ply him with sparkling wine and pastries stuffed with Nightingale's tongues. Come, Geralt, what do you think's happened to him? I reckon he's at the bottom of the pontar, trussed up with the strings of his old mandolin. Loot. Far as I'm concerned, he might as well be rotting down there with a goddamn trombone. You wouldn't happen to have a bone to pick with Dandelion, would you? Of course I do. You serious? Dead serious. Dandelion published a sonnet recently. Second stanza, the shit uses paired couplets instead of an inserted rhyme. Surely you understand how deeply offended the poetry lover in me was. The bastard shan't get away with it. <laughs> I was being serious. As am I when I say I have exactly no time to worry about your jiggler or boyfriend. Got me own problems. Problems you might be able to help me with. And if you did, why then I might be inclined to ask after Dandelion, establish what happened to him. Maybe I can help. What do you need? I'd rather show than tell. Picture's worth a thousand words and all that tribe. Ah, and you do realize, if you say anything about what you see here to anyone, it'll mean a razor between your ribs. Yeah, yeah. Figured as much. Excellent. One last request. Oh, let's call it what it is. A command. Don't draw your sword unless I ask you to. Okay, so which one is in your quest? Lol. Be so kind as to follow me. De coño. Uh, toco tokens, tokens. I need to go to the to the to the How can I go? I'm here, I'm here. Oh my god. Bah, stop that. Now. Costia. Mad. Bad make Ziggy lose Jonathan. Beating your head against the wall won't change that. Ziggy. But, huh, but less thinky. But less thinky. But sadness. I poor. Why are you bring me here? Don't seem to have trouble communicating with the troll. Why'd you bring me down here? Take note of that hole. We'll come back to it later. And see that door? Vault behind it, until recently filled with Novigrad crowns and countless other valuables. But God! 
Then boom! Chorfun, go! Translating into common, someone fucking made up with nearly 20 tons of my gold and all the lighter stuff. And you will help me get it back. Okay, take care of things. Why don't you handle this? Gotta have connections in the underworld. What do you need a witcher for? Uh, the gold wasn't mine alone. See, I run a members-only savings club, a bank for the initiated. For reasons that should be obvious, I prefer it if my temporary liquidity problems remained private. So I need an outsider. How do you know you can trust me? I don't. Counting on your survival instinct. Slip up, and I'll kill you. Feed you to Bart. Bart, sorry. Bart jumped that good. <laughs> Fine. I'll help you. You're not exactly bursting with enthusiasm. Which I mean, no. Mutations, they strip us of emotion. I'd be jumping for joy otherwise. All right. Ought to look around. But first, some questions. I'm Which invitations? <laughs> I'm gonna say that from now on. <laughs> mm, what are we saying? What's the value? How much was it all worth? Got an approximate idea? Why the fuck do you care? Figuring your finder's fee. Don't get your hopes up. Know you too well for that. Just prefer to know what I'm looking for. Three crates of Nilfgaardian florins, a chest of emeralds, rubies and topazes, silver candlesticks and platters. I could go on. Shiny Chorfun. Oh, God. How do you feel about that? Maybe we can solve it. I still don't know where the hell is at. Anyone see what happened? Other than Bart? No. Just going your the vault's location is known only to the treasure's co-owners. Well, and the thieves. What about upstairs? Anything unusual happened in the bathhouse the day of the break-in? No. Happen swears it was calm as ever. The usual customers, no incidents. Bloody bucolic. Was bad, bad, bad should talk. He talks, no? Take it the thieves got in through the hole behind you. You're a regular fucking master sleuth. Any other brilliant deductions you want confirmed? The year, maybe? Bloody name of Redania's king? No, but I am wondering, for instance, how that hole got there. Hole, oh, no. Boom. Hole. Bad look won't go. Bad look, no. Only sleep. Bad shoes. So they head fall. Boom. Bad mushrooms? Bad mushrooms? What's that about? Pops mold. The spores are highly toxic. One whiff and you're dead. Unless you're a troll, that is. Yes. Bad. Bad troll. Not talking to you, dimwit. Where was I? Ah, mold spores. They cover the walls of the sewers other side of the vault. Actually thought it was a good thing, you know? A bit of extra protection. Thieves found a way through it. But you see them? But through all. Once see, boom, got what? Breathe, shroom. Sleep, go. Jorfun, gone. Bad, troll. Now, now. Stiff up a lip. Boom. Can you elaborate? Boom. Can you elaborate? Boom. Big. This like. I'll elaborate. Explosion. Big enough to blow that fucking hole in the wall, separating the vault from the sewers. Gotten pretty good at communicating with this troll. Lots of prior experience. Worked with idiots my whole life. Um... Try to track down the thief yourself? Of course. 
I had this lummox fonts, thick enough not to ask questions. We knocked back some pops antidote and entered the sewers. Soon after, I returned alone. What happened? Lad started belching something horrendous. I mean, burps with so much mass the walls shook. Told him, Fonz, stop. You're in the presence of a count. Well, former count, but still. And then he puked up. Up came most of the antidote. Lost his protection. Tried to pull him out. Then I heard a bubbling. Something crawled out of the water. I value the lives of my men. I do. But I value my own even more. Dropped Fonz and ran like hell. Something came out of the water. Uh, gotta look around the sewers. What kind of something? Mind describing this something that crawled out of the water? No. Doesn't mean I can, though. Air in the sewers thick with spores. Can hardly see a thing down there. Must have noticed something. Was it... No! Didn't notice a fucking thing. Didn't do a taxonomic field analysis either. I know it's an inconvenience to you, but I felt I should get the hell out of there as fast as I could. Should look around the sewers. Got any more of that pop's antidote? Have a few vials left. Got the formula too. Disgusting swill, to be honest. But it'll save your life, here. Thank you. Thanks. You've not to thank me for, literally. You're no good to me if you suffocate. Listen, I'll be upstairs if you need me. Sight of this empty vault's giving me an ulcer. Good luck to you. Dandelion, what the hell have you gotten yourself into? I'm not sure that it was a... Uh... So if I have some of those uh, things, inventory... Potions... Wolven... Didn't he give me something at uh, this one? Pop Mold's Antidote. Edges curled out. Something inside blew it wide open. Wall two. Hmm. Bathhouse drain pipes seem to converge here. Fire guys. Yes, it's true. Eh. Uh, but I'm not the one. Like I'm not having any problem. No, in here. No. Pipes great. Explosion crumpled it like a piece of paper, and there's mortar on the bars. So it was in place at the time of the explosion. Last tore it from the wall. Of course, it was in place. No traces of magic. This was no spell. It was a bomb. Now, why am I not finding pieces of it? Could be the current swept them away. Mmm. Ah, that's the thing. Okay. Shouldn't go any further without taking that antidote. No, it doesn't work. Yeah. Oh, I thought witches potions were vile. Oh, here. Fine grading. Couldn't push much through that. I'm hearing things. Sounds, it's so creepy. Yeah. 
Where am I? Person, right? The thug digs to her head. Nothing here? I cannot believe it. There you go. Oh, look. Dijkstra didn't mention anyone else. Must be one of Dandelion's crew. Vomit everywhere. It was a, it's true, it was... <laughs> Couldn't keep it down any more than the other guy. Getting closer in the corpses. Otherwise, Dranner's one of the only Hey, 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 hey! What the fuck? Can you take your sword, stupid... It's true, he doesn't know that it was Dan the Lion. I think I check everything now in here. I didn't left anything. Yeah, another shiny bubble. Yeah, they had something. They had something. But what are those sounds? How good I am. I'm almost nearby. You see, you see? Um so through here. Here, Dandelion must have loaded the treasure onto a boat. You need to search the sewer from within. I searched the sewer already. Think he's gonna. Oh. You think he's gonna be here around? No, no. Something, I'm missing something from there. I'm missing something. Because I I actually see it's very bad. Ah, oh, here. Hmm. Bottom of a container. Silver cylinder most likely. Runes etched in the bottom. It's warped. Probably by the explosion. Bomb part. Must be. Smells like wyvern oil and caramel. Wyvern oil? Get down here. Time to see Dijkstra. Okay. More antidote. I already have it. What is that sound?
Wait, 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 wait. I have an idea. I have an idea. I can loot this? No. I know. Another trinket. No, no, no. Don't you hear it? Is it just me, the one that hears? It's a pipe clear over here. Must have been one powerful blast. No, que no, que no. It sounds like a, like a, like a ghost. Hey, well, don't tell me that I'm the mentor because I'm not. I mean, I come from there. Give me that. I oh, know this is the throne. Yeah. I think the throne has a lot to do with this. You are. You're really fun. Thank you very much, Bianca. Oh. They reproduce super fast, the flowers. Hola, guapo. Yes. Can you pay me attention? Got a minute? I do. What do you want? Um... Done. Done. Examined every nook of the sewers near your vault. Well, learn anything? Thieves lure the treasures into a bowl. Found one of these. Found pieces of the bowl. Found a second corpse. One of the thieves. Threw up the antidote just like your man Fonz. A beautiful death. Anything on the body? Not much. Empty vial. Mm. Wouldn't have left him behind if he was anybody. Common porter, must be. Knew nothing, means nothing. Dead end. Literally. Jesus of the bomb. Seems to me a bomb blew the wall open. Look. Bottom of a silver cylinder, probably. Covered in runes. Interesting. Any idea what it contained? Recognized some ingredients by their scent. Wyvern oil and sugar. Sugar? Geralt, I'm in no mood for jests. Mm. This was on the lion. I just don't know. No, I, that's what I'm saying. Nor am I. Just saying what I found. Bomb contained sugar. Let's think. Sugar would react violently with sulfuric acid, but not so violently to cause an explosion. Didn't know you were versed in alchemy. Dabbled in it a bit while at Oxenford Academy. But this is no time to reminisce. You're to find my treasure, not write my biography. Know anything else about this bomb? Anything at all? Um. The bomb was in the pipe. Bomb went off inside a drainage pipe embedded in the vault wall. But the grate at the end of the pipe was in place when the blast happened. Meaning... The bomb must have found its way into the pipe from inside the bathhouse. Exactly. Might have gone something like this. Perpetrator started emptying one of the pools, then dropped the bomb down the drain. The bomb flowed down with a runoff, came to rest on the grate, and, to quote Bart, big boom. <laughs> to quote Bart. Um, let's see which friend. Let's. I think it's Drain the one that I couldn't use before. Lead. We just need to know which pool it's connected to. Yes. Atom keeps a record of guests. Should be able to tell us who used that pool the day of the breaking. You've not done badly. 
feel honored Latch, to be Latch. acknowledged. Oh, that famous sarcasm. I missed it. Really? Hmm. About as much as I'd miss a knife in my knickers. All right. You inspect the pools on the right. I'll take the ones on the left. Holler if you find anything. Okay. I think I know which one it is. It was this one, no? No, it wasn't this one. Shoo. This one. Hmm. Nothing interesting here. Oh, okay. Ah. Phew. So here. Ah, this one, this one, this one, is this one. This one, this one's half petroleum. Something floating on the surface. Oil looks like. Do you see petroleum? Like my mom used to say. Yeah, but when now? Oh, oh, here. Silver lid matches the cylinder bottom I found in the sewer. Dijkstra, come here. Got something? Yeah, bomb part. Happen. Drain pool four, and bring me the guest book. Chop chop. Chop chop. By the way, happens. Not a subject. Let's see what's on the bottom. Subject. Let's see what's on the subject. Either way, what about happen? Could have overheard you mention the vault has access to the bathhouse whenever he wants. Happen has numerous flaws. He's pompous, Wait. pretentious, can be a real prick sometimes, ironic as that may sound. But his loyalty is beyond question. How can you be so sure? Witches know their monsters, spies know their men. You trusted Philippa Eilhart once too. True. But I didn't pull Philippa Eilhart out of a Kaviri prison the night before her execution. Okay. I didn't see who it was, but uh, Shersi, hello! And thank you for the poster check. Let's see what's on the bottom. Grate's been removed from the drain, meaning they flushed the bomb down here. Happen? Who used this pool the day of the break in? Let me see. Uh, Bertolt Heights, town councilman, Josef Schweik, brewer, and Margrave Henkel. Henkel? That's impossible. Who's that? Margrave Henkel. Who's that? Who was that, you mean? Old Coach's been eating dirt since last winter. Couldn't have been here the day of the breaking. He's dead. I've not heard. Not surprising. The Honorable Margrave croaked in a brothel, decked out in leather lingerie, so the family held a hush hush funeral. My sources. Yeah. Yeah, I saw him that fateful day, Mr. Reuven. I'm certain of it. Did you speak to him? Get a good look at him? No. You merely passed by on the way in. So you didn't see Henkel. You saw an impersonator. Think for once. They scooped out your balls, not your brain. And you, Geralt, start looking into this. Um. Uh... Like, I care if he's nice or not. Fine. Where should I start? Henkel's home. Derelict townhouse south of the main square. You might happen on some trace of this scoundrel we're looking for there. Well, off with you. Hey, what an ass. Um, how are Linda? Hello, Cersei. I'm okay. How about you? How have you been doing? Did you get used to the... To the controller at the end. I think this is still 
level 11 no uh, no I'm not in this one What do you want? What do you want? Leave the stench of blood about you. Ah, oh, what a nasty woman. Here. What a dump. Looks more like a beggar's hovel than a Margrave's townhouse. And Elian made some interesting friends. It's 10.55. How is that too early, though? How is that too early? <laughs> Can I not go in? No. Uh, nothing hurts as much as not. What? Oh my god, they're gonna kill me now. 